Hey guys, I'm Max and uh, welcome to a new episode of my Let's Play uh, Test Drive Unlimited 2 video. Um, as you can see, I have a new car. Um, this is not uh, bought by me. This was one at uh, a big tournament that I, that I uh, participated on. And um, <clears throat> because I won the tournament, they decided to give me a new car. And uh, that's, uh, they, that's nice of them, but that's not the great news. The, the great news is uh, that they gave me one million dollars as well. Or one million euros, I don't know, let me see. No, it's one million dollars. So, yeah, the prize was one car. This car right here, which is quite sweet. And one million dollars. That's, that's an amazing prize, guys. That's... But, to be honest, it was quite hard. I mean, there were, there were some, uh, some races where, for example, I had a race where I just had to travel the entire, the entire island. Like, let me show you. Like, the entire island, this island, the entire island, through here, and like this, and go back. And it took me, like, one hour. So the race took me like one hour to finish. So yeah, that's that's kind of why uh, I guess they gave me one million dollars and this car because I won uh, that big race and that big tournament. But um, yeah, I'm having lots of fun uh, because obviously I got the new car that uh, is way more fast. Uh, as you can see, it's... The, the engine sounds great on it as well uh, and sometimes sometimes I uh, I go into those things and crash but not now uh, <clears throat> let me uh, let me ask you guys one question what what view do you guys prefer like you, you like the far view you like the close view you like the interior view, you like the uh, on the engine view, or you like uh, the road view. I don't know uh, which one you like. <clears throat> Recently, to be honest, I have played, uh, I have mostly played it like this, because uh, I kind of like seeing my car now. Um, I used to play it like this, but look how limited you are. I mean, Yes, it's realistic, but you are quite limited at the view you have, and uh, I think this view is way better, I think, at least for videos, because <clears throat> people usually want to see the car, right, I mean, so you guys can, uh, can leave me a comment and tell me what you guys think, uh, what view should I, uh, should I use, what view do you guys prefer, uh, so I know. I should stick to that view, or I should switch them. I don't know, maybe you guys like to switch them and see different views all the time. And, uh, yeah. Now, because I finished that big race and uh, that big tournament, a new island has opened to me. Uh, this new island is uh, actually the island from the first game, uh, Test Drive Unlimited 1. And from what I understand, it's way bigger than this one, which is quite crazy because when you buy this game you think like whoa this island is big and then you get to discover that you you have access to another island that is like two times this which I know sounds crazy like it's they're giving you two games in one but it's true it's true and they're awesome for it um, now I don't like uh, the developers take on DLC they, they have been re releasing some DLC about like uh, um, being able to get some some cars by <clears throat> paying them uh, like paying real money for the cars. Uh, you still have to buy them in game with your in-game money. So I don't know. <laughs> like I don't know how I feel about that. I usually don't enjoy DLC, paid DLC, paid DLC because to be honest. Um, like look at the Call of Duty series. I don't wanna. I don't wanna say anything bad about that series because uh, I know it has lots of fanboys, and they're just gonna come to this video and they're gonna troll. But 
I don't enjoy the, the DLC. I mean, I don't want to pay... I don't want to pay real money for a few maps. Me being a PC gamer and all, uh, you, we usually make the maps on our own with the mod tools that developers are giving us. But the developers are not giving us mod tools anymore because they want to release DLC, pay DLC, and they can make money. So I don't know. I don't know what you guys think about that. You can leave me a comment on that as well. Uh, it's quite an interesting subject, which I you honestly don't have a, don't have an answer for. <clears throat> but let's get back. Let's get back to our game. Let's. Uh, I'm gonna show you guys. So this is the first island. <clears throat> And as you can see over here, we have the airport. Now, if you go to the airport, you can travel to the first island, to the second island, excuse me. So I'm gonna show you guys right now what I mean. So this is the airport. Um, it's an avatar zone, as you can see. You have other players as well that are buying tickets and they're, uh, they're going uh, to the uh, second island. I'm gonna do the same. I'm gonna try to buy a ticket from this lady over here. So I'm not gonna stay at that uh, that place. So let's see. So fly to Hawaii. Okay. Take this flight. Yes. Here's your <clears throat> ticket. Have a nice trip. As you can see, the game has uh, text chat as well. Now, I don't know about that text chat. Usually, I see many uh, like weird languages there. Uh, not so many people are speaking English. I don't know why. Uh, maybe it's my uh, my bad luck. I don't know. But yeah. Whoa! So it's raining. Another great thing about this game is the rain. Um, it's dynamic. You can see when it happens by uh, looking at your TV, um, which is amazing if you think about it. You can look at the, the, the TV and tell, like, tomorrow is going to be rainy, today is going to be sunny. Uh, so that's a feature that I, n n like, I never see in games. But, um, yeah, this, this I know. Whoa. Hi, it's Todd. So that guy is speedy. But to be honest, that guy has a Bugatti, so yeah, not that much I, I, I can do about that. He is always going to be way speedier than me, but um, yeah, I, 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 I like the rain in the sense that it's a great effect, but if you try to make a wrong turn, like look, look how crazy handling is, you see that? You can't handle the car. Like it's slippery and all, and uh, I don't like that. Um, like when you go to races, usually if it rains, you see it's better to just skip the races until it's sunny and then take the races when it's sunny. Cause yeah, whoa, thunder. No, that's uh, that's um, not something you want to hit you. A thunderbolt. This is what I don't understand. In the first game, you had the uh, shield wipers, or whatever they're called. Um, now in this one, you don't have them. You just see water going up your uh, windshield, but it's it's like it's you can't do anything about it. It's like there, and that's it. And as you can see, those uh, those in the background are other players. Um, that of course you can go to them and say, "Hey, you can flash your uh, your light." Say, "Hey, want to race?" Of course, I'm not gonna go race with those guys because they are like level 40 and I am low level, and they have awesome awesome cars. And I have my car is is good, but it's good for my level category. It's not. Like, it, it's not gonna uh, take on those guys. 
which is perfectly fine. Um, but yeah, look at those reflection guys on the on the road. I love it. I, look how realistic it is. But um, I'm not sure that you guys want to see me drive through rain. So let's uh, try and I'm going to show you the island. So this island is like two times bigger than the, the old one. Uh, from what I understand, I don't know exactly, but that seems to be the, the case. Now this is the airport, I think. Or this is an airport. And I think I, our airport is here. Yeah. So let's take it. I'm gonna fly back because I want uh, I want to test out some cars um, like you know how I told you that I, I have like one million dollars because I won that race now I want to buy a car with those money with those uh, with, with that cash but uh, I don't know exactly what car so let's go see and now there have been, uh, oh, hey, what the hell, uh, now, I have seen a new, like a new car dealership on the map, uh, uh, the Mercedes one, I think it is, I think it is, I'm not sure, but let's go see, so look in the top right corner, I have one million dollars, one like one and a half and I'm just looking for a car, a nice car to drive um, but I'm not sure if uh, Mercedes is for me um, might just go and buy a, a, a very powerful car um, something like a Bugatti I think well, let's go test out this car. Let's see how it, how it, um, how it goes. Oh. Oh, it's powerful. Looks good as well, but... Yeah, not sure it is for me. I mean, <clears throat> I never drive Mercedes, but, uh, a Mercedes car. Never, um never quite liked him, I don't know why. Now it's raining on this island as well, what's happening? <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. The handling is way off on this one. Look at this, I'm just trying to accelerate. Whoa. If you don't accelerate smoothly like this, then you go over time. If you accelerate fast, like this, like, you can be trying to take a corner. It's crazy. Nah. I don't like this one. And uh, I'm guessing you guys want to see that one. Over there. It's kind of weird because it's raining outside. But let's test it out. It's quite wide. Wow. It's quite wide. Interesting interior. Yeah, I don't know about this one. Uh, I don't like the look of it. I don't like the look of it one bit. It's it's quite strong, but again, the handling just ruins it for me. Maybe it is just because I—I I mean, it could just just be because of the the water on the on the road. But still, if you if you get this bad handling with water on the road, then yeah, you have to think of all situation, guys, because it can happen. It can rain, and you need a car that can handle the rain as well. I mean, you have to get used to cars uh, over time. 
Like, you have to get used to cars in real life. Because each one of them are, are quite different in, uh, in the handling and the driving. And you feel them. You feel that they're different and that's, that's a good thing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> we just reached the beach. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm not liking this one either. <clears throat> Let's see. I'm gonna get out of here. And we're gonna go... <clears throat> Let's see. I'm not sure where to go. There are so many... British cars... Bugatti. This this has Bugatti in it. So let's see the prices. This one is a good one as well, but I I don't really like it that much. Um, let's see, a Bugatti is <laughs> quite expensive. Quite expensive. It's way out. Like it's it's more than I have, and this one is way more than I have. So yeah, I think I'm not gonna get a Bugatti after all. Because you guys might say, yeah, well, go take some races and make the money. But it's not about that. It's I need a house as well. Uh, like on the second island. So I need like ha like at least 400,000. I need it for my, um, for, my, uh, for my house. So yeah, let's think. I'm going to search for, um, for something else that is cheaper. It's not this. Huh. Used cars. No, I'm not wanting to buy used cars. Oh, a Zonda. Yeah, this could be a, a good idea. Let's see the prices. Oh, the prices are not that high. Which is great. They're getting higher as I'm I'm going through. <clears throat> like this is is way expensive than those are, and I don't know why. Like, let's see, acceleration 86, and this acceleration 88. Okay, so it's a bit powerful. Uh, 68 speed, 70 speed, and braking 87, braking 87. So. Hmm. I'm not sure which one should I get. Like this, that one is a bit more powerful, but is it really worth the difference in money? I'm not exactly sure about that. Let's get into the car and see how it is. <clears throat> no. Of course it's gonna look good inside. Let's see the other one. And the <coughs> those ones I think are, are not that powerful as those are. This one is carbon black. Which I like. But the interior are... Are not as awesome as uh, in that one. Which that, that's why I think uh, the difference is there. Like you can see this has the standard interior as that one has. Uh, <clears throat> but if you look at that one, that one is, has a better interior, I think. <clears throat> yeah, all of the cars, all of the, the Zondas have uh, a certain interior, but this one has something special. Like it has different interior, sport interior. Which I like, and uh, that's why I am gonna buy this one. Let's buy. And uh, yeah, it doesn't give us any possibility of painting the car. For now, I can just go to a shop, I think, and repaint it. But I just uh, 
I just bought me a Zonda. Oh, achievement unlocked. Big spender. Oh, look at this, guys. Look at this beauty. Oh, level up. Level 13. Can you believe it, guys? Can you believe it? I just bought a Zonda. This... This is amazing. I, I love this car. And of course, it's very, very speedy. You have to be very careful with this car. It's it's gonna tear worlds apart. Oh, <laughs> do you see that? <clears throat> this guy has uh, his trunk open. Look. <laughs> That guy is what? <coughs> Something is very wrong here. So as you can see, uh, if you've seen, I cancelled that call, but that was actually the police. So the police will call you when someone is misbehaving on the streets and will ask you, well, this guy is acting bad. You can turn into a policeman and follow and chase him down. And every player in the surrounding area is going to turn into a policeman and chase him down. So it's usually not a good idea to, to mess with the police because they're going to take all the drivers around you and they're going to turn them around, they're going to turn them against you. Uh, and uh, yeah, you don't want to mess with with other players, like, they're going to take you down easily. And, whoa! Yeah, I feel the power, but I need to be a bit more careful. Let's see the interior view. Like, you can see in other cars, the, the interior view is very limited, but in this one, you actually have a big view in the interior, which, by the if you look here, like the, the windshield is big, 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 so you can see everything. <clears throat> uh, but yeah, that's, uh, that's about it with this video. Um, I'm sorry that uh, I didn't get to show you more of the, the second island, but I'm sure I'm going to show you more of it in the next video, because that's where I'm going to like make take my new uh, new cars that's where I'm gonna make my new races um, so yeah um, hope to see you again soon and uh, till then have fun bye bye